I wanted to be lots of things. Be in a band. <laughs> I wanted to play for the Rough Riders. <laughs> and then I was like, I'll probably just go to U of S or something and take law because that was the expected route for me. But I met Jason in grade 11 at our career fair. But I always thought, Bible college? That's a waste of time and money. So I wasn't really interested in Bible college at all. And I knew my parents were kind of expecting me to go to university. I went to U of S for three years. I started to realize that, wow, I feel like I don't want to be going down this route. I don't feel called to this. I remember taking the entrance exam for law school and I just felt like a stranger and I felt lost. Since I met Jason, he's always been connecting with me through Facebook and every time he sends me something, hey Josh, I just know it's gonna be about Bible college or campus days. And it's like, I know I'm not going to this. And I remember always going through the email to check his message so it doesn't say seen on Facebook Messenger. <laughs> Finally, I got the conference to actually go on the app, actually have it say seen at whatever time, and say, hey Jason, can we FaceTime about this? I just felt more certain about Bible college and what that is like and what that could be like. And my parents were not opposed to me going to Bible college. They just wanted me to go to law, finish it, and graduate, and then go to Bible college my older sister. She was always there to give me spiritual advice. And when I was struggling with Bible college, I was like, okay, what do I do? And she said, I encourage you to really pray about this. Ask God deep down in your heart, is this where you want me to go? I told him, if you know that God is calling you, he'll put you there no matter what, and he'll put you in the right place in his time. When I got here, I remember opening the door and greeting Jason and I got a text and it said, Dad, <laughs> and it said, we know you're in the right place. Just take care, be safe, brush your teeth. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Coming here was a blast. Well, eventually everyone told me I acted like I was best friends with everyone <laughs> coming here. <laughs> but everyone was just really nice and I felt like I really fit in. The more he's sharing stuff about what's going on in Bible school, the more I'm being assured and very thankful that the teachers there, the staff there actually like really care for him. 724 is our discipleship groups that meet, it is a staff and about four students uh, meet up at a time to say, okay, how are you doing? How is your walk with God? It's not about me, it's about Jesus. And that's what I'm here for. Just being in this environment, I was like, well, this is totally different from where I'm used to. It's changed the way I pray changed the way I see things, how I play sports, how I play that guitar and sing. And I don't regret my time at U of S, but what I do regret is not coming to Bible college first. Because Bible college gave me a foundation. I think that's why it's called Foundations for Life, the first year program. I can honestly say that this is one of the best decisions I've made in my life.